Well, let's look back at when it all started it, for the second time this season. We had the Bentley leading us down towards turn one. Bit of a difficult start for Oman Racing by TF Sport to the right of picture there. They were passed by Stefan Ortelli straight away at the start as Ollie Milroy got on the front foot, got himself up into third place in the early stages of the race. This was Abriel making uh, Louis Pret, sorry, making his way through into fourth place at the start as they made their way up Eau Rouge for the first time and onto the Camel Straight. Brilliant racing in GT Cup Open Europe, Mastante versus Manel Cercada. And we had lots of battling going on for eighth place as well. Jens Lieberhauser going through past Marcelo Hahn eventually. As, uh, Chris, as Patrick Kaprinski also got through. This was the moment he did it up Eau Rouge. There you can see Jens Lieberhauser going past Marcelo Hahn and also going through a little bit of side-by-side -side contact. But Kaprinski would also go through and into ninth place. 28 minutes in, the pit stops would happen. And after them, Vince Abriel was the one got to move forward. This was when he went past the Yannick Bettler, got the run out of the chicane and eventually completing that move at La Source. Brendan Ivory did lead after the pit stops, but uh, started to drop down the order. Enrique Chavez there going through to take position. This was the moment for Stante took the lead on Daniel Diaz Varela. Joe Osborne going through, and then we had out of Stante go through and into the lead, and he would never be seen again. But uh, Vincent Abriel would drive the car to the win with Enrique Chavez back in fourth. That closes the gap to just one point going into tomorrow.